Erwin Royster, Director for Outreach Services at Planned Parenthood of Metropolitan Washington. And with me is the Program Manager of, uh, of Planned Parenthood, specifically of the Ophelia Egypt Program Center. And here we provide a lot of structured and valuable out of school time for teens living east of the river. Certainly we have heard the alarming rates of STDs and HIV that affects the youth in the District of Columbia. We are a safe haven for youth to come in to get medically accurate, age appropriate information while they're not in school. If kids weren't in the center right now, I I'm sure they would be out there doing something else that may not be to the betterment of them. But they're here today, and we're about to embark on something really great, and we're promoting a wonderful product, which is a female condom. And what we're doing today is challenging the youth to come up with a way for us to tell more folks about ways in which they can put another piece of arsenal into their safer sex kit. Well, as a program manager here at the Affiliate Program Center, it gives me great pleasure to work with a lot of our young people, particularly high school age young people. And we like to say we're the intersection between comprehensive reproductive health education and youth development. You can't just talk to young people about sex. We know that they're having it. We want them to be safer about it. That's a decision that they've made. But we talk about everything from abstinence to the other end of the spectrum. And as Erwin said, again, the female condom, the new female condom, again, is something else that they can put in their safer sex toolkit as we like to call it. So we definitely, you know, want to acknowledge the fact that, you know, we were, you know, funded to do this work. One of five agencies in D.C. funded by Mac AIDS Fund, the Washington AIDS Partnership, and the D.C. Department of Health. So we're really eternally grateful to them for this opportunity to really get the word out to our young people. Here we call our young people youth health messengers, and we have trained over 25 youth health messengers to go out and talk to their peers, to be able to give them correct information, to demonstrate for them and educate them about the new female condom, as well as other choices in terms of contraception. And so they can make healthier decisions about their life. You know, it's a big bad world out here. And when they leave our building, they encounter all types of things, you know, that could get them into trouble in their decision making. And so we want to, you know, equip them with some skills to make some very uh, serious decisions, you know, with some thought behind them and understanding what they're getting themselves into. I have to say tonight, we're really excited. One of the things that we have to do is to be able to reach young people where they are. And so tonight is a perfect example of us, an opportunity to reach our young people where they are. We know they love to beat their feet, especially our young men and the young ladies like to watch. So what better, you know, method or tool to get some young people into the center, some additional young people into the center who we may not see otherwise, and to teach them, you know, allow them to express their skills and then to teach them more about the female condom.
What's the deal, DC? It's your man, Tony Reyes from 95.5 WPGC. DC's official number one for hip hop and R&B. And of course, you can catch me in the street with the Bounce Beat Kings. I'm trying to tell you, we do it real heavy. Tonight was a, a phenomenal situation where we had young people representing that FC2 condom. That's a new female condom that protects you from STDs and of course, HIV and AIDS and also teen pregnancy. You make sure you pick it up, ladies out there. This is a brand new brand new product that's on the line and it's made of nitrate. That's the same product that they use in surgical gloves so you get that actual feeling where it does not hold you back from anything and if you're sensitive you can use all type of lubricants with it so that FC2 is that new hot product that you need to use to keep you safe and protected out there and we beat your feet against HIV and AIDS okay. Thank mm -hmm. you.